Well, they're probably one of the best teams to ever play college football. And we're talking about the 2001 Miami Hurricanes. That team won the national title. And on their offensive line was Crestwood's Martin Bibla. Well, Martin is back in NEPA, raising his two boys, Lincoln and Magnus. And currently, he's an assistant coach with the Crestwood Comets. And tonight, they wrestle Pittston. At 2.15, Crestwood's Magnus Bibla. It means the world to me to be able to be around my boys. Um, I've been given the opportunity to help coach, assistant coach with wrestling, assistant coach with football. Uh, and they're the exact sports that uh, my boys are in. So to be around them, watching them grow, and, uh, and, and give them a little piece of my mind is, means the world to me. I don't know if they appreciate it as much, uh, but I do, I do enjoy my time. It really means a lot. It really keeps the pressure on me, knowing my dad's always watching, expecting the most from me, and it gives me great results with uh, his pressure. That Hurricane team had guys like Clinton Portis and Willis McGahee and six foot nine inch Bryant McKinney alongside Bibla at right tackle. It means the world to me. It's, uh, it's regarded as one of the best teams of all time. Um, Brian McKinney is being selected as College Football Hall of Fame. Uh, I was able to be surrounded by some pretty spectacular people. Uh, I didn't know what I had when I had it. Uh, now looking back at it, it's, uh, it's truly uh, a, a, a diamond in a rough. A fourth round pick in the 2002 NFL Draft, Bibla played three seasons for the Falcons and was on the Broncos practice squad. Now he's with the Pennsylvania State Police working out of the barracks in Hazleton. I enjoyed the camaraderie of, of the people that I played with. Uh, with being a state trooper currently in recruiting, uh, I preach that same concept. Um, being in football and being in the police are, are, are the same, same to me as far as uh, being around the guys. With the hopes of a District 2 wrestling title awaiting for Magnus, a future in football could also be knocking on the door very soon. Steve Lloyd, Newswatch 16 Sports, Luzerne County.